Our players do not like my can, actually. They don't like me very much. They are a little bit intimidated. Where am I playing? Am I playing Jung? Alright, it's another blue can game. My MMR is so bad. How am I getting plus 8? Hey, can we ward my red? I kind of was AFK level 1. I don't need you in lane. Get out. Get out. Get out of my face. Get out of my face! I don't need you. How many kills can I get this game without saying get gnomed? That's probably should be the next channel point bet, honestly. Leona losing that much HP at level 1? Nah, but you're trolling, what? Your melee support getting outgraded level 1 by double range. If my bot lane doesn't win this game, that's a sad Drew's moment. I mean, I feel like they just win. Like, the only way that we lose is if we don't win. And I don't not want to win, so I find it quite impossible. Uh, we have really good comp for Ross, but sadly I'm going blue because I'm a moron, I guess. The thing is, is that blue is just more fun. After all, I play for fun. They have Power of Evil and Huni in the same team. LCS laners literally just tower dive at level 5. Holy shit, because they know they can. Imagine being that good at the game, you just know you can. Oh wait, never mind, they can't. Uh, I'm so ahead in XP in CS. Just seem to be able to do anything with it. That's the hard part, doing anything with my lead. Getting a lead, easy. Doing something with the lead, hard. Yeah, I get his ult for free, I guess. Divey and Orn. You guys laugh at these players, but they're actually two of the best players in the region. Actually, two of the best players in their own regions. This is one of the best players in EU and one of the best players from Korea. You guys are laughing at them. So next time you guys insult me, remember that you literally would insult some of the best players in the world. Power of Evil and Huni. I just realized, aren't they on the same fucking team? So they're probably in comms right now. So that was a comms call play too. You know how epic this win's gonna be if I win? Beating TSM. Epic pwnage montage. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clear all my bot side camps and then head up top side. Go use the rift. Just watch out. Just gonna look for a gank or something. That's exactly what I pinged. Um, do I wanna stay and try and help? I don't think I can. Just back off. I'm gonna go farm. 3-0, he doesn't need to play aggressive here. Let's give up Krugs. No point being aggressive. Let me just farm. This is where I build my lead and then I just chill. So I farm three camps. Actually, no, I farm four camps in the time that she's farming one. She gets two camps here, Scuttle and my Krugs, and I just get all this. And I get a reset and be way stronger than her on the map. This type of decision making is what makes you a good player. Can TSM lose every game they played? I couldn't tell you honestly. Every time I try and watch LCS, I fall asleep. But I've been trying to say that to be mean. It's just, I don't know. I, I just fall asleep. Like, I don't know how else to put it. I wouldn't necessarily call it boring. It's just every time I put it on, I wind up falling asleep. I feel like I'm going to find Irelia here. Hey, Irelia. Oh shit. Ow. There's four top, holy shit. I'm not sure what to do about that. I'm gonna rip top. Leona can free rotate. Ryze can free rotate. At least it's really fucking behind, but still popping off. You got that, don't you? Yeah. I need to just like fight Rise or something. You get my form ASAP if I want to win this. Form wins game here for sure. I don't know what I do with my bot lane. I think they don't have some like Samira though. Hit Samira against our comp. Holy shit. Team, I got the wrong form. I'm pulling a TSM and getting a really, really late cane form here. I could lower my orb timer by continuing to hit range champ, so maybe I just do that here. Honestly. Okay, that lowers it by a little bit. I do good damage to the thing, it's just some no form. Ah, oh, that's gonna be really rough, actually. I actually find this game very winnable if I could just get form safely. Because we have Samira. 
not Samira, Seraphine and uh, Soraka. God, it just feels so bad waiting for form. Every second that ticks by, I should be making plays, but I'm just not. Like, can't. I just farm. I don't want to build. Dude, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be so huge once I get my form. Oh my god. Just wait for my form. Wait my form. It'll be up before Dragon too. Oh my god, that's going to be huge. We fight the Dragon and we win. Nice. Um. Huge, holy shit. Well, I'm an insane psycho. Really, there's no R here. Only way that I throw this game is if I misclick my form. <laughs> I've actually done that once. It's the worst feeling in the world. Oh wait, she didn't go through. Damn, I think I just lost out in the kill for us here. I played that so poorly. <laughs> Jesus. I want to take everything from her. I don't want to give her anything. Both put chat, just remember. I played against Power of Evil and Huni, and I cracked them both. <laughs> There's my versus TSM. I just go Edge of Knights. Just be smart. Because look at how I almost got Perma CC there. Uh, honestly, it might be a move. We have like the slowest Baron on planet Earth. I hate to break it, you guys, but we do it so slow. It's actually miserably slow. I don't like about Edge Knights. It gives you no lethality, but it's still a really good item. But it's not an offensive item. It's more of a defensive item with offensive uh, perks. Speaking of perks, is Perks playing on NA? I haven't seen him at all. So look here. The ladder. Yes, sir. Okay, I'm, I think I'm finally getting the hang of this Prowler's Claw build now, guys. I'm actually able to 1v9 with it. I think I'm finally starting to get the hang of it. I'm liking Prowler's Claw now. Jeez. I can finally play Kane again. I'm, all I do is get comfortable with Prowler's Claw. It's actually such a good item. I didn't realize how good it is until I learned how to play with it. I just thought it was really useless before, but you just have to be really smart with it. See, that's the thing, is I wasn't playing smart. Now I'm playing smart. We can still lose this game, so let's just play it smart. See, that, that's the thing that uh, a lot of people don't realize, is that the higher you get in Challenger, the more you need to know how to close a game out. Guys, I actually do not have Smite here at all, so um, I'm going to look to zone her. Finish it, yeah. I look to zone there, because I don't have Smite, so. We're all aware of my lack of Smite there, so we just play it how uh, smart you normally should. Oh, she's actually pretty tanky with Arm Guard. Nice, right, so I'll have to use Flash there. That was actually very close to being very bad. <laughs> you guys like the little Prowlers combo? The little the little s slide in and out. Lamau, Irelia are Huni mad. Twitch chat, you guys are insulting like one of the best top laners in the world. You guys realize that. You guys are mean. You guys are savage, actually. You make me feel so insecure when I play now. I know I make so many mistakes. You guys are calling out someone who's like literally almost one worlds. That being said, I'm pretty sure Power of Evil and Huni are gonna ban Kane the rest of the day. Whoa, we're at 700 OP again, boys. Nice. Honestly, Orn carried the game. All Orn with a hint of Charismai. With a hint.